Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. In my previous video, I showed you how to create a beautiful website for a smoothie shop in WordPress using Midjourney and ChatGPT. Check the link on top of your screen. Today, I want to take it a step further and show you how to get the perfect logo for that website using Midjourney, ChatGPT and Adobe Photoshop. So if you are looking to create a unique and eye-catching logo for your business, you are in the right place, guys. Let's dive in. So at the beginning, I went to ChatGPT and I asked to summarize the warning logo in five words, as you can see. But before that, I just tried to monitor and guide ChatGPT, like for example, on top, like I said, I want to create a logo for a website by using Me Journey. This website is a smoothie shop. Do you understand? He said yes, but he didn't look like he did know what is Me Journey. So I tried to correct him. And then I said, what is a good logo for a smoothie shop website? And uh, ChatGPT gave me some descriptions. And then I tried to summarize here. So I said, can you summarize a good logo for such website type in two lines, please? So he gave me some summarize over here. And after that, I tried even to go furthermore. So give me with give me five or six words to describe it, please. I mean, the logo. OK, so he says, here are five words that could describe a good logo for a smoothie shop website. Fresh playful, vibrant, whimsical, and simple. Then I went to my journey and asked to give me a logo for a smoothie shop website. And then I tried to implement uh, the descriptive that given by uh, ChatGPT. So I asked him to give me a logo. The logo has to be fresh, playful, vibrant, whimsical, simple. And then I added the spec ratio parameter free free. Uh, the spec ratio parameter has to be at the end of your text prompt in mid journey. Okay. It's not an obligation to add the spec ratio, but if you are searching for a logo, it I think it has to be a square to be beautiful, to be a beautiful and good logo. Okay. It has to be a square and you have the obligation to add uh, the spec ratio when you want to add a, or specify an spec ratio you've got to add it at the end of your text prompting me journey so as you can see right here I've chose this one but the result given by me journey was this okay they look so beautiful so fresh so playful so colorful but I've chose the simplest one and I think it's this one okay so I've chose this one, as you can see right here, which is this. Yeah, it's simple, it's good, it's colorful. Yeah, I like it. Now I'm going to download this logo, then try to remove its background in Adobe Photoshop because it's better when a logo has no background. So let's do this. And there you have it. Using Mid Journey, we were able to create a stunning logo for our Smoothie Shop website in just a few minutes. So in the next video, I'll be showing you how to add this logo to a WordPress website. So be sure 
to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on the next video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.